Dubai Aquarium marked a historic world's first with the launch of the assisted breeding program for one of its star inhabitants, the sand tiger shark. Dubai Aquarium has the largest population of sand tiger sharks, also known as the gray nurse shark in an aquarium. The species is listed as ecologically vulnerable on the International Union for Conservation of Nature Red List of Threatened Species. With a project, there is a big hope to protect endangered sand tiger sharks from extinction for at least another 100 years. The breeding program uses artificial insemination and a gene bank will be used to hold the genes of sand tiger sharks. Sand tiger shark population in the world dropped to an estimated 1,500. Without intervention, it is expected to be extinct in the next three decades. Sand tiger sharks are unique because the females only breed every two years with a maximum of two pups. Now that the aquarium is established and we've been operating for more than five years now, our attention is moving towards conservation. So what we want to do is be a, uh, a cornerstone of the, of the animal world and, and play our part in learning about the, the, the different species and what they need to reproduce and survive in the wild. So this is certainly a new phase for us and we're looking forward to uh, making our contributions to conservation. Now we have a large number of sharks here that, that are, are not seen often around the world. So the reproduction of sharks is something that science doesn't really have a good understanding of. And shark populations worldwide are declining and understanding what a shark needs to reproduce is, is critically important. So we're starting work on some projects like a shark artificial insemination project where we can learn the reproductive cycles and exactly when sharks need to mate and gestation periods and try to create the entire cycle here inside the aquarium. That information is then fed back to our counterpart scientists in the wild and they can help, it can help them make decisions, inform decisions when looking at wild populations. One project in particular that we're working on is Carcarius taurus or the sand tiger shark. Now in some parts of the world, this shark is critically endangered and despite the fact that they're creating marine parks and conservation areas for, the, for these sharks, their population still declines. In these circumstances, the scientists really need to know about the reproductive cycle of the animals and, and how, if necessary, we can actually intervene with captive breeding programs. So one thing we're working on here is Carcarius taurus and artificial insemination. Scientists from Australia, where the, where the sand tiger shark is critically endangered, are actually flying to Dubai Aquarium and they'll be spending months with us working with our animals and trying to create that understanding. A cryogenic lab has been set up to support the program and visitors will be able to see the work being done and the behind-the-scenes operations of the aquarium. The long-term project will develop technology that could eventually be used to artificially inseminate various species of sharks. Irish Eden Beleza for Gulf News.